Here's some reasons on why I think acne is just ugly and overall embarrassing to have. Okay guys, so those are all the reasons. And stay all the way to the end. Comment down below a purple heart. Bye guys, and remember that God loves you. We're doing an ASMR get ready with me because I don't feel like talking. And you guys can see like my full makeup routine. It goes this way. Glow recipe toner. I only use this like
is pretty. Get ready with me for the 126th day of school. Long time, no school, get ready with me. Happy April, I am loving life right now. But on a scale of one to 10, how believable was that? But happy April, I am so glad that March is done. I was watching Nicole's video on her college acceptances. And to be honest, even though I did get into my dream school, it did not make that video any less relatable. Like just feeling the tension whenever you get that email, like, oh, there's a status update to your application. I would literally just lock myself into my room and open the letters by myself because I did not want anyone near me. There were two schools that I didn't get into. One of them had a 12% acceptance rate, the other one had like 25% acceptance rate. So you know what? I'll take it. Yesterday there was technically school, but I didn't go. Basically sophomores were taking PSATs, so I would have spent all eight periods in illustration. I think not. So instead of going to school, I went through the process of renewing my passport because I'm going on a cruise for my 18th birthday. My mom just made me change my pants because of the rain. We are finished. Deuces, deuces, and deuces. Get ready with me for school, except for the fact that my whole entire house woke up late today for some reason, so it's 6 o'clock instead of 4 o'clock. Something is, like, actually wrong with me because I keep falling asleep literally everywhere. Like, I can't stop falling asleep no matter how hard I try. I'm using the Fenty Beauty Concealer today because I just cleaned out all of my makeup and I found it again. Even if I eat breakfast or even if I don't eat breakfast, I'm still so nervous in school. Like, my stomach will hurt all day and it's just like like ugh, i don't win i'm literally so tired like i can't even think of anything to say to you guys because like all i can think is i'm tired <laughs> last night my mom woke me up well not woke me up she just barged into my room so she would have woke me up just to ask me where four bags of jelly beans were keep in mind i was asleep from 3 30 to like 5 30 yesterday then i got up took a shower and went back to my room how would I know where four bags of jelly beans is? I don't know, but then I got up to help her look for the jelly beans and we couldn't find them, so she literally lost four bags of jelly beans. 6.19, I literally started my makeup at 6.10, so we're really good on timing. Along with, wait, what am I yapping about? Along with, like, not being able to stay awake, I also have not been hungry at all for the past, like, week. Yeah, last night was really fun. Before I went to bed, I was on the phone with my brother and then I was on the phone with someone else. I just love to yap, like I love yapping. Too Faced sent me their plumping lip gloss, lip injection lip gloss. It's really cute though, but I wanna put it on. Everyone in my house is so scared of lip plumpers because they burn, but like I love them. And this one's thick. Setting spray. Okay, have a great day. I love you so much, bye. Get ready with me for school. Okay guys, so I have to pick up my outfit now. Okay, so it's either be flare leggings and then like this blue top or these jeans with the brown shirt. Okay, we're gonna wear the other outfit tomorrow. To stay. Oh, I'm just a kid. Tell me why I got banned again. But since I kind of got to stay positive, I'm literally just going to say that, like, me making a new account is going to give me more opportunities. I really want to try staying consistent with TikTok. So I'm going to try doing that with this account. Oh my god, I am white. I made an Instagram, so maybe you guys can follow that. So then I could like post like the question things and then I could like answer those on Get Ready With Me. I literally like love doing Get Ready With Me. Like I literally just like talking, like talking, that's literally it. Like if someone lets me talk, I will talk their ears off. Oh my god. Tell me why we're not even on summer break and I'm already talking about how my fits are going to eat next year. Like, I love summer, but I've never had a bathing suit before. 
mainly because i don't even like shorts on me so i don't know how i'm gonna feel about a bathing suit but like also the only places i could get bathing suits is from hollister because they finally sell extra extra small but literally tell me why like a bathing suit top is like 35 dollars don't get scared guys this is gonna get fixed with concealer okay so i dyed my hair this spring break right and even though i don't want to say like oh like i'll let people's like comments define me if like more than 10 people comment on it and say it looks bad i will literally go to a store and buy new box dye because i cannot go around like knowing that like other people think my hair looks bad just kidding i can't like kill my hair more but literally if someone does bro i'm gonna be like sad like i'm gonna be like damn i'm walking around thinking i look good while we're waiting for that to dry we're gonna put on my perfumes and deodorant Okay, but for real, I am going to lock in the semester because I had two B's last year and I want a 4.0 for promotion. But like, the only thing that's really stopping me is P because girl, why do I have to dress out? Okay, since like next year I'm going to be in high school, I really want to try out for sports. But don't take my word for it because I might just be all talk because like I know I am not athletic. I literally can't get over the fact that people like spend like $40 on a concealer i think my $12 concealer is expensive bro but yeah anyways about the sports thing i really want to become a cheerleader but why is that like a thousand dollars bro i'm over here complaining about a $12 concealer where am i gonna find a thousand dollars the real main reason why i want to join a sports because like i want to have a bond with like teammates I would join like volleyball, but on the real now, I'm kind of scared of getting hit by the ball, so I don't really know. Why is it that when I'm baking, I like feel like my most prettiest? Like when like I have my bake on, like I feel like like I could literally just walk out. Like if that was normalized, I would walk out like that. Gotta be baking these smile lines. I'm always scared of one of those girls that walk around thinking they're pretty and then they're like fugly, bro. Wait, no, because what if that's what people think about me? What if they're like, oh, she thinks she's all that? But I don't think I'm all that. I really don't. Okay, guys, this is getting serious. I got to tie up my hair and now we're gonna drench my face. Bro, someone for real gotta give me Spotify Premium because what are these ads? Okay, guys, so my lip combo is Milani um, Understatement Lip Liner in the color. Girl, I don't know, but. That color, and then the NYX Butter Gloss in the shade Sugar High, and then this is a She Glam like lip gloss. Bro, I remember like in the beginning of summer, I pulled out all my lashes on this eye, and now these lashes are like way thicker than these lashes. Okay, I'm gonna pack my bag. We gotta take my two perfumes. Bro, like I took my Sol de Janeiro, like I would take it like every day, and it's almost gone because everyone would ask to use it. I'm not gonna tell them no. Dynamite, Sour Patch Kids. Should I put these in a bag? Okay, guys, do you think I should be cool or aesthetic? Cool aesthetic, cool aesthetic. This cup is in the washroom. I'm not trying to do that, so I'm gonna take this one. Come on, let's go. Bye, guys. Love you. Get ready with me for school the day back from spring break. I procrastinated all my spring break homework and I'm dreading school. Anyway, I was adding people to my private stories on Snap. You know when like you take your time to change who's in your story, take some people out, add some new people in, and then when you go to click save, it says like error, check your connection or something, and then it just doesn't save. That's what happened and it's so annoying. Anyway, yesterday my family and I went out to eat. So then my dad told me, he was like, it's funny because when you're really happy and excited, you want others to also have a good time and you want to spread that happiness. But when you're struggling, you're feeling insecure or you're feeling anxious, you want to give that anxiety and security to other people he wasn't talking to me specifically but he was kind of implying that that's what i was doing i didn't say anything in the moment because i felt like attacked and then i just wanted to get defensive but then after i was thinking about it like as i was falling asleep and i was like yeah like he's right if someone says something that hurts my confidence i'm probably going to want to say something that hurts theirs you know like a comeback or something like that but if i'm feeling really happy then i'm probably going to want other people to feel happy that's something that i'm probably going to be thinking about a lot now okay i'm done getting ready bye guys Hey guys, get ready with me. Okay, so I got my Invisalign today. And I took it out for the video because I have a really bad lisp with it. But the bumps on my teeth feel very weird. Um, I don't like them at all. But it's okay, anything's better than braces. 
Okay, so I know I said I didn't like these that much, but I'm feeling like very summery today, so we're gonna do them. I just think they're like really overpriced. Anyways, the UV was 10 today, so I went out and tan, and it's like I freaking love tanning so much. Check out the ring tan. Okay, it's not even that good, but I swear it'll get way better in the summertime. Anyways, back to what I was saying about tanning. I like love it. I know there's a lot of people like saying I like being tan, but I don't physically like tanning, but I physically like it. It's kind of weird. Like I love the blistering sun on my skin and sweating. Like it's awesome. And I feel like it goes by so fast. Like whenever I'm tanning, I put on a show and I'll be just out in the sun for an hour. A lot of you guys are asking where this set was from. It is from Altered State, along with my dress in that one video. If you saw the story, it was the video I made on Easter. Have any of you guys seen like the what I got for Easter and then it's a flippin' iMac? Because that was on my For You page the other day and I was like, what the crap? This girl got two Tiffany's and an iMac and I was like... And I thought my mom went overboard with Easter. Like, I swear, I thought I was getting spoiled. Which I think I was getting spoiled. Like, I feel like I got a lot for Easter. But f damn, like, what? Anyways, for Easter, I bought my mommy flowers because I love her. But she was telling me about, like, how whenever my dad used to get her flowers, she used to, like, save them in a shoebox. Which I thought was really cute. But then they divorced. I've seen all these videos on my For You page saying, so we're wearing tankinis this summer. And I don't know who's we, but we is not me. I will not be caught dead wearing a flipping tankini. Like, I didn't get a belly button piercing to hide it. Okay, guys, I'm gonna remember my brows today. Because, yeah. Today, I, like, ripped a nail off. Because I'm tired of these nails, and I've had them for a month. And they're so overgrown and keep getting caught under my hair. Like, it's actually so annoying. Alright, guys. Thanks for watching today's Get Ready With Me.